Welcome in a universe community. My name is Sanchita Pandey and our topic of discussion for today is Are you feeling down and out? So what are the ways in which you can activate your energy and feel rejuvenated? So here are five ways in this video which will leave you absolutely energetic and happy. Before we begin with the video, the first thing I would like to remind you is that natural instinct is to get up early in the morning with a lot of energy and, and looking forward to do things that matter to you, that you love to do. And if that is not so, then you also have to revisit as to the for example, your place of work or the people who surround you because they have a lot of impact on your energy level. As I said in my earlier videos, there is constant exchange of energy between everything around you and with everyone around you. So if you do not like to get up in the morning, nothing to look forward to, it also means that you are going against the current. You are not going downstream, you are going upstream. You have to, you have to work against something, your inner being, to go to that job, to be with those people. So now it is high time to take a decision and change make a change in case this is the reason why you are not feeling energetic now i'm not talking about sickness either if you're not sick and still you're well and still when you get up in the morning you are not feeling energetic and don't feel like getting up and doing something now what are the five ways in which you can rejuvenate yourself, fill yourself with lot of energy. So here we go. The first way which can energize you is take a shower and get ready. Those party dresses that you have kept in your almira, come on, take them out and wear something bright. Colors also matter. And, and get ready as if you are going to a wonderful place. For example, when I started making these YouTube videos, I had to get ready because I had to look presentable to make content. It became a habit to get up early in the morning and get ready. That gives a lot of energy. This is my personal experience. So when you wear good clothes, the way you are walking, the way you think, everything, everything changes. So, Take a shower. Now why taking a shower also important because that changes your vibrations. It is a fresh vibration. You are ready for a new day. And then beautiful clothes make you feel good. The colors have an impact on your emotion. So bright colors, dark colors or your favorite colors, they all have lot of impact on your emotions. So wear your favorite color and get ready to sit in your house or to go out. So the second way in which you can energize yourself is go out for a stroll or if you do not want to go out just meditate or you can just walk down any road, any road and enjoy nature or talking to strangers, anybody you meet on the way, vegetable vendors or that shopkeeper you know, anyone that gives lot of energy. So this makes me come to my third point that there is something known as shopping therapy also. So you can just go out to the market, not necessary that you buy something, but just looking at colorful clothes and knowing about the new trends also may energize you. Asking questions, having a conversation with someone, 
having an argument with someone all that does give you lot of energy and knowing something new wow these are the colorful clothes this is the latest trend and all this will certain certainly give you lot of energy so after this shopping therapy or window shopping you it is your choice we come to a fourth point that may energize you and which is dance just start dancing but you may say i am not feeling good and you are asking me to dance you see what happens is when you are not feeling quite good or lethargic your em emotions are guiding your body now you need little very little will power and now you just start moving your body there is flow of energy within your body which changes something within and you will notice that you feel better so you are actually changing changing your energy also your emotions were guiding your body now it is the other way round your body starts guiding your emotions so while you were not feeling like dancing you start dancing and there is good energy flow of energy within all seven chakras in your body there is a shift in energy within your body and now your body is guiding your emotions and though you may still not feel very very active but still you will see that your face lights up there is a smile on your face as you turn the music on and start dancing your body is guiding your emotions and your face will eventually light up and now you will feel a shift certain kind of shift that is you will feel good so what is the shift emotions were guiding your body and now it is the other way around your body is guiding the emotions your body is dancing so emotion on the face has to be yay yes i feel good come on faster <laughs> faster dance so that way you change your mood and you change your feelings and thereby you change your vibration just switch on those beautiful melodious songs you have always loved to hear then you can paint you can listen to your favorite favorite uh, books audio books or watch documentaries or inspiring interviews or spiritual uh, videos like these in a universe community or any such videos any content that interests you and now coming to the fifth point is watching comedy videos when you watch comedy though you are not feeling good there are talented comedians who will see that you are left laughing and that will change your mood and thereby your energy now coming to the end of this video you also have to address this question as to what is it that makes you feel lethargic you have to address that issue also make a change make a shift there so that you are living your life downstream doing all that you love to do being with people who make you feel good in a place that makes you feel good that is your space and this space is very very essential to enjoy well being and good mental and emotional and physical health that is your world you create for your own well being that is self love and self care so anything toxic keep it out of that space which you have created that peaceful meditative space and do more of what you love to do now before we end this video let me also tell you what makes me feel very energetic and very happy every day i get up really really enthusiastic each day because i am looking forward to finishing lot of things or starting lot of things so 
I have a lot of ideas in my mind and I have to implement those ideas so there is always so much to do which makes me get out of the bed really energized. But however, in case some days, all days are not same, so in case I am not feeling very energized then one, music is something which energizes me and it can be it changes, the singers change every day. So it can be one singer one day, another singer another day and sometimes it is me. I sit and listen to my own songs which I feel very very soothing. Why? It just is. I, I, it is like all the stress or whatever it was that was not making me feel good. Something has absorbed all of that and I feel so peaceful after listening to my own tutor video tutorials or my own songs and I have seen it many times. So that is something which energizes me. Another thing is making reels. It is so much fun to make reels. Why? Because one, you have to be, you have to look happy and enthusiastic before you switch on the camera to make a reel. You have, it is all about entertainment and so again when you switch over your mood for whatever reason, for me it is because I have to make a reel, actually your mood changes because it is all about jokes or motivating videos or dialogues on the reel and that gives lot of energy. Another way is to go out and sit in the nature or me time, that is alone time with myself, doing music, listening to music or yoga. I love to do yoga. So these us are going to the beach, yes. I would miss the beach. So it is fun living near the beach. And yes, going to the beach and collecting shells there or just sitting and watching and saying thank you. All that, it leaves me so energized. I also love to spend quality time with my family and talking about general, general things in life and sharing our love for each other, appreciating each other. It is really a lot of fun being with them or sometimes we are just reading books not talking at all and still their presence makes me very comfortable and loved sometimes we don't feel like doing something for example today you do not like to go to the gym so instead of taking a full day off from the gym and exercising what you can do is go for 15 minutes that's it just 15 minutes so 15 minutes of exercise can produce those good hormones, happy hormones in your body and you will feel good and you won't get that inertia of rest also. It is like if you do not go to the gym one day or you do not exercise for one day, you actually end up not exercising for the entire week. And so a good idea is to take out just 15 minutes. This may require a lot of willpower but still, just go for 15 minutes, come back. So next day, you can follow the same schedule that is one hour of gym. So we have to recognize the fact that all days are not same. Sometimes we feel energized, sometimes we don't feel like doing something. We have to respect our feelings also and yet still remain motivated and disciplined. So instead of taking one extreme step and then another extreme step, not working at all or working too hard, you can take the middle way also. Working for, working for some time, that's it. And being kind to yourself, respecting your feelings, own your feelings. If you're not feeling quite energized today, it's fine. Accept those feelings, but still, you know that generally you are a happy person. What can you do to change those emotions so that you keep vibrating high? So these five points will help you to keep your vibrations high and remain energized.
So it is always the small things that can leave us energized or can suck our energy. So take care of your life energy. Life energy is the most precious possession you have. Keep it first. Take care of it like a treasure. So be in a place with people doing things you love to do so that you can save this precious treasure that you own. Thank you so much in a universe community. This is all in this video. We'll meet again in our next video with a new topic for you. You can also suggest some topics, interesting topics. And I'll try to make videos on that. My new book is about to be published, which is called Spiritually Rich. So we are waiting for the book to be published soon. It will be available on Amazon. Thank you. Bye. Namaste.